Should be audio. There we go. Now we have the camera rolling. We're back. Okay, we're Hi. back. What's up? Hi! <laughs> Yeah, maybe not that loud until after the cast is done. <laughs> We're filming in a secret covert operation. If you saw the trailer that Taylor's gonna post, and I posted on my page. I already posted it. Did you? I did. I, posted I didn't it. see it. I did it. Well, because unlike did you. Did you tag me in it? I actually tag you in this stuff, unlike how you. But did you tag, tag me, or did you tag your podcast? I tagged your podcast. Oh, I don't know. The yeah, podcast. you don't know your podcast. I don't name. have the page anymore. Why not? I haven't logged in so long that they logged me out of it. Oh my god, that is horrible. I mean, I guess I still have it if I log in. Yeah, you still have it somewhere. You just have to find where you have it. This is what your listeners have missed. Us they have back and missed forth. this. They Hi guys, we're back! Yay! My faggoty voice is back. Yes. Along with Taylor's weave. Look, he got a weave just for you guys. Look, look how cute. Uh, oh, I, I gotta, I gotta, I just put it up. Oh my god, this took forever. That's okay, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it's, you'll, you'll, it's, there we go. It's long. Do we toot luxurious. or boot this? We toot it. We toot the hell out of it. We toot it like a rock star. Season 12. Season 12. I pledge allegiance to the drag. Oh my god. And the fag. Ooh, and the fag. a lot of people. Do you have a lot of PC listeners? I have no listeners, so I don't care. I do not have any PC listeners that I know of, and if I do, they probably shouldn't be listening. I mean, also, I'm a fag, so I can say I'm a fag. Are you? You're. Watch me. Bye, it. You're a cigarette? So. In Europe? We're back. It's season 12. It is season um, 12. It's season of New York, basically. Pretty much. Like, most of the girls from this Wait, what, five queens are New York queens. Okay. okay. So, this will be um, a long episode, even though Taylor said, I hope it's not uh -huh. Bikini. So, let's it's start. Not terribly long. Okay, so we are going to start. So, we have. First up, we have the alcoholic herself, y'all thirsty, Miss Britta Filter. Which, you know, I know y'all thirsty probably was mean because Britta Filter, but she drank it out of a martini glass, so... Did she? Yeah, look, she... Uh, oh yeah, she, that is a martini glass, isn't it? If you were just doing a regular youth thirsty, then why not have a hydro flask? That is true. That you well, snuck alcohol in. I think because the um, martini glass plays better on screen than a hydro flask or a flask of some other sort. Or why not have one of those, like... A oh, Brita filter Indian. thing, like, but uh, oh, that would have been cool. She's too. also not using the name Brita filter though on the show. She's, she's just using Brita. Brita because of names. Yeah. What was it? Someone else. Jan Sport. Right. Yeah. Just she's Jan. only going Jan. Just Jan. Just Jan. So Brita comes in with an ugly ass. You didn't like her outfit? No, I don't like this outfit at all. I'm sorry. Well, I mean, it's it, okay. No, okay. It's a nice outfit. It, but not for your entrance look. It shows off her curves, but it's not quite an entrance look. Look, we have all agree. season to look at her curves. Okay? That's true. You that have is... all to see these curves, mm -hmm. too. Look at it. All 12 of them. That um, is true. You liked it, though, apparently. I like her. I didn't necessarily like her outfit, but I like her. See, it's a nice outfit. I like the, um, what do they call this thing? Her little fascinator. Right. I liked thing. it. The hair is nice. The fox is random. She does have like some... Her name is Brittle Foxy Filter. That's true. And yeah, she does have some big hair going on, so that's good, because you know how Michelle likes a big... Right, and it's cute. Hair. Don't get me wrong, just not for her open air. Yeah, no. Next up, we have... What's her name? <laughs> Fuck. This is Nikki Doll. Nikki Doll, right. Nikki Who Doll she is... named herself, we later find out, after Nicki Minaj. Yeah, she is our the French um, queen. I call this Jailhouse Rock with a Rosebud. I can see that. Because her asshole is blown out. To the yeah. Side. She is, yeah. We like I'm, it? I I kind of like it, but I mean, I can get, you know, she's a French girl, so she has a different outlook on fashion than we do here in America. Okay. So, and I And we mean, have another fascinator. Yes. It's not as big. Not as big. Mm, I like it. I don't love it. I like the face. Boop. She's very, she's very, very pretty. She's very girl. fishy. She's, she's but better. But again, not for your opening entrance no. look. You want something a little bit grander. Can I just say, so far I've not been impressed by any of these looks. So now we have Widow Vondu, which... I am... I don't know. Widow Vondu, like... I like the hair. Again, I like the outfit. So maybe this weird thing on the side yeah. shoulder. My problem is you can't see her. She's so dark and her outfit is so dark that it's like, where is she? And that's what Sasha was saying too on Pit Stop with Bob the Drag Queen that she wore all black. So it's hard to read when you wear all black. Yeah. I mean, you can see her eyes. You can see the sequins. But that's about it. I want a pop of color somewhere. A pop of color. We need that pop of color. Red. 
pink, yellow, yes. something to be like not so. Mo- I don't like the monochromatic. Yeah, no. We need well, that. We're just haters, aren't we? We are haters. I promise. I'll like one of these outfits. Oh wait, here comes Braddock. Maybe. Oh man, Lord. All right, pop a color. All right, I hope you all enjoyed that commercial break. Yeah, we're, we're back. back. Our sponsors. sponsors. Do you have sponsors um, or anything? We have like 75 sponsors, but none of them give us money or actually talk about the show or advertise with us. But there are sponsors but and hey, we love them. Have yeah. you made money from it yet? Not a dime. Mm-hmm. I've actually been sent bills from some of them, which is awkward, but you know. Okay. Hey. All right. So this is the camera. <laughs> well, this is our season um, 12 filter. Oh, what is this? Yes. No, it's the, it's the light, but it's not quite doing what it should be doing. Like that. You're at Okay. Nope. <laughs> nope, we're just gonna kill the light. Kill it! Kill it! Alright. We're in the red the whole time. Okay, so we're back. Kill it! Alright, we're back with our next girl. Jackie Cox. Another Jackie New York Cox. queen. I like her. She said... Hmm. <laughs> I like her. I just wish uh, that the camera would stop dying. All right. Uh, I like Jackie. <laughs> the camera hates me. She, Jackie's fun. She's a um, she's a good girl. Ish. I'm not being seen. You're not being seen. Oh, wait, let's, let's, let's adjust the camera. There we go. Yay! Yay for being Putting seen. Them. You know what I need is um. I used, to have, screen, I used so. to have one here. I need a um, thing that I can plug in to charge it. I mean, we do need a wide screen. We need to get a sponsor mm-hmm. that will give us money to buy a wide screen. Wouldn't that be nice? So if you have money and you want to send it to us to buy a wide screen, we tried to get Janae to do it, but she was like, I'm poor, I have no money. And then mm-hmm. she charged us for the wide screen that we tried to get. But send her money also, because she needs money. Because she's poor. And she needs money. Okay, so Jackie Cox. Jackie Cox. <laughs> For those of you who are only listening to this, um, Taylor's camera has erectile dysfunction. It does. It keeps falling. It keeps, it keeps uh, falling down. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're back up. We're back up. We're back up. Okay, here we go. Okay. So My face. Jackie Cox. I like her. She said she is the Annette Funicello of drag. Serving looks wise. What did I say? Oh, she's a Persian princess. She is Persian. So um, her, um... She's also, little known fact, Robbie Turner's twin. I was, like, commenting on that the entire episode. I'm like, she looks like Robbie Turner. It's kind of scary, but, you know, a younger Robbie Turner and a more put-together Robbie Turner. Yes. I do but, like this outfit. Again... Too simple. It's like a cheerleader outfit, but I do like that her name... It's very musketeer outfit. So, when she was saying her name, she was like... And she's going backwards. She's like, it's, it says Jacqueline or Jackie. Jacqueline. So, do they write from left to right? Or, like how uh, we right both had the thing where we're like... Because it goes... It like right goes the right. opposite. So like, so, like Japanese. Or did she purposely write it that way so that it would pick up the correct way in the camera or something? Like, I don't know. That but would be smart. It was cute, though. I like her little bow tie on her head. The bow is cute. Mm-hmm. Okay, Next Mayhem up. Miller. I mean, um... You racist. Her voice. Hiding in closet. I her like her face, voice. Her voice. <laughs> it's all very Mayhem Miller to me. A little bit of Mayhem Miller, but and also a little, a little bit of Kennedy Davenport. Yeah, a little Kennedy also. Davenport. A little Miss Fame with the ice cream like, and chicken. Mayhem da- Davenport fame. Yeah. Miss... Yeah. Miss Mayhem Davenport. But that's a whole lot of pink. That's a, and then print. she also called it, but she called it, um, what did she call it? Oh, leprosy print. Leprosy print. Because, okay. you know, leprosy, that's what, yeah. you know, yeah. you find them in the wild. Oh, yeah, totally. Well, <laughs> maybe we'll just do an audio from here on in. Maybe. I don't know. Hold on, we're going to flip the script here a second. Hold up, hold up. Okay, so we'll just go from that angle. Now we're cut off. Well, a little. I mean, your head is kind of cut off, but that's also just because you have a big ego. And hair. And hair. Which is the same. Hair, 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 hair. Okay, so now we're on Miss Leprosy Prince, which is not... I think she wants to say tiger? I think so. We're going to have that whole... Or zebra? She's trying to do the whole brown cow stunning thing. 
Brown cow like, stunning is a ooh, awesome sensation. I see brown cow, not giraffe, you know, thing. And, mm -hmm. you know, but, you know, she's... She's going to come back for All Stars 5. Yes, her apparently. teeth are going to be fixed. No, I think the teeth are going to become her trademark. Yeah? Yeah, I think so. She's going for that Madonna look. Madonna. Madonna. And then okay. the outfits get crazy. Scarlet Envy. <laughs> That's what I thought, too. Also, Alaska. Alaska. Also, as our friend Sarah likes to call her, teeth. Yes. Or meaty tuck. Because that is a really meaty tuck there. That is a meaty tuck. She's going um, for um, Pirates of the Caribbean. I like it. It's cute. Um, this is finally something that's like entrance worthy because this is something oh, you're not gonna forget. We didn't say her name though. She oh, her name is Gigi Good. <laughs> Am I right? I'm horrible with names. You all know this. You all know who's been listening to our podcast now. <laughs> I am terrible with names, and we're just getting to know them. Yes. Gigi Good. Which, no, I'm not because I don't want to curse it. But remember that thing I told you yes. about? Okay. But yes, no, that was bad. But yes, I remember that. Yes. yes. Okay. It was bad, but it was good. Oh. But we liked it. We liked it. I like it. It's very parts of the Caribbean. My it's only thing parts. is that whole meaty tuck. It looks I also, like... yeah, the elongated crotch. Yeah. I'm never a fan of that. I didn't like that. I did not like She's that at all. She's white, too. Mm -hmm. Like, damn. She's a porcelain doll. I don't like, okay. Okay, we're looking at the entrances, obviously. And if you're following along with us, I do not like the garters. Because the garters look like you're a maid. Yeah. That's the only thing I don't like. That's the only thing. Um, her mom made the costume. Yes, because her mom is a uh, seamstress. But she like... seems, she sews also. She seems also. Yes. She's a sewstress. Um, and then we have... Thorgy 2.0. Thorgy 2.0 slash young weird Al Yankovic. Slash... This is Crystal Method. Not to be confused with Crystal from UK. Yes. Because hers was it Crystal, was it Crystal Meth? Crystal, well, she's supposed to be Crystal Method, I think. Crystal Meth. In UK? Feminine. No, Crystal in UK. Is it was Crystal Meth. No, I think, I think she was Crystal. Or was she I think she was Crystal Meth, but they couldn't oh. say Crystal Meth. Oh. Crystal Method, dressed in Michelle Fizzle's favorite color. This green clown outfit. Dressed up as Bianca Del Rio. Who wore it better? I'm Bianca. Crystal Method, and I'm a little devil, is what she says. She's, she's fun, though. Like, I, I like her. It took me a little while to warm up to her because that... Her first outfit, I'm like, is she trying to do blackface? What her first outfit? She was in like, she had like a, like, for the wrap portion, she was like this brown. Oh, no, it was yeah. like red. Was it red? No, her red was after for the wrap. No, 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 but it was like red. Like, is it? It didn't yeah, look yeah. red to me. Maybe I gotta get my glasses checked or something, mm, I don't know. You just went to. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, do we also have another meaty tuck here? Mm, it's hard to tell because she's wearing loose pants. Yeah. Overall, though, I like it because it's a statement piece. Yeah. It's cute. It it makes a yeah. yeah. It makes a statement. It's it's fun. It's memorable. Okay. Now so we're from on to that, the runway. Do so we have do you have do you think any of these girls have top three material? Not particularly, but I so for anyone who didn't watch though, they are doing um instead of one whole meet the queens. They're doing two. They've cut it into two season premieres, similar to how they did in one season and seven. Two. Another disruption. It's gonna be the um. Stop and go. It's gonna be the episode of Stop and Go. Welcome to our Stop and Go episode. Okay, Stop and but go. real quickly, I feel like the way if they're doing it as they always do with Drag Race, Britta's probably gonna get far, because it's always the queens I don't like that get far. Yeah. Or don't just I think personally don't think deserve to go far. She'll go far. Britta Comey came in also very confident. I do like that she's the first Polynesian queen. I do too, from Tonga. Yeah, so that's a good, that's a, that's a um, She says favor. she is by day Moana, uh, Maui, by night Moana. Yeah. And I was like, Moana put in some weight? <laughs> well, Moana was, you know. Moana's a little thick. Do you ever notice how you haven't seen Hey Hey for a while, or that, uh, or Pua? Because she ate them. She ate them. Mm. Yeah. She had a cool pig and chicken and on rice. And she ate Maui. No, but I mean, she's a, she's a Polynesian, so she's a curvy girl. And she right, wears right, it right. Well. Yeah. So. Her first dress, which is supposed to be like a water cast. So we're doing type sp so spring runways. Spring runways. Did you like this? It's very. I mean, it's cute, but it's very I plain. I hate it. <laughs> Thank you. It's very. I was plain. like. I don't like the way the wrinkles are falling on her. I don't like how she took off her tulle skirt, and everyone was like, "Oh my god, so amazing!" Oh my god, it's a two in one. I'm like, she took off her skirt, mm -hmm. which maybe was even a mistake. Yeah. No, because she no, took it off. she took it off deliberately. But, I mean, it's... The hair is nice. The gown is cute. The hair is nice. Not my favorite. Yeah. Next. Next up, we have Nikki Dole. Nikki Dole. I liked Nikki's outfit. 
Uh huh. It's simple, but it's elegant. Mm -hmm. It is definitely something you would see on a fashion runway and not just walking down the street to go get your groceries. She's channeling nymph. Yeah. Um, I thought this was ugly. <laughs> I don't like it. You don't like it's it? It's so plain. You, it looks like you went to Walmart last minute, bought some flowers, well, attached to your front and your back. Because you had a simple skirt that you borrowed from your friend's closet. I'm sorry. But it's it's um, it's um French fashion. It's, you know, it's not American fashion, but it's French fashion. Well, then I Americanly don't like it. Yeah. Uh, I American. She American. I am American. American. Oh, boy. No. <laughs> Widow Von Doom. She came out. Okay, so I was watching this with my friend Sarah. She came out and we were both like, what the fuck is this? I get I like also Where that RuPaul going, didn't know what it was. She's like, what is neoprene. this? And they're like, it's neoprene. And she's like, oh. I like how they try and tie this look into the main stage competition theme, even though they had no idea at the time what their main stage competition theme was going to be. Mm, it was like she was a Pokemon evolution, actually. Yeah. Evolutionizing? No, uh, evolving. Evolving, That's what I'm yeah. For. So it's and neoprene, it's, it's pink and green. It's and gross. She, has also, big, who wears this in spring? Yeah, she wears this big headpiece that she, un, you know, takes off her hood. Where are you going it. in hot spring Yeah, to wear this? No. Hot spring neoprene? Next. Move along. Oh, she's back again. We don't back, back again. All right. I like this I like look. this look. Jackie I Cox. Like it. I like it. Uh, 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 I uh, like uh. it. It's very 1960s. It's very period. It's very, yeah. It's very, I want her to, like, all of a sudden break out into sweet Rich charity. Fruit, yes. Yes, exactly. Uh, very cute. Do, 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 uh, do, the boots? Do, 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 do. I like the boots. Are plain, but I do like them. She's a very Bond girl looking type. I like the colors. She's in the yeah. pink. And a woman always carries a purse. Exactly. It is known that a woman do carry a purse. Mm -hmm. I like it. Bless her heart with this one. <sighs> Heidi in closet. I liked it. I liked it. She looks like she opened up the closet door and just wore whatever came out. This reminds me of remember that, that runway where uh, Jasmine Masters uh, season where they had to be a cocoon. Yeah. So what exactly is that though? Like, is that a headpiece on her so dress? Like, is her dress part? It's a flesh jack on her head. Uh huh. That kind of I wish down, like she got her dress caught in and was just like fuck it I'm going out yeah, yeah, like yeah. this. Because... I wish that because her thing fell off. Yeah. I wish that when it fell off it was purposeful that so that her hair like hair would reveal itself. Mm -hmm. That would have been such a yeah. No. No. But and it just fell off. But she kept going. She kept going, but she didn't like make it into something and recover it. She's just like, I'm just gonna exit yeah. now. She said bye. Yeah. She's like, she said, Alicia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, I'm out of here. GG good. It's it could work. It could work. For that race car who wants driver who wants to get all dressed up for spring. I wish this was a reveal. Because it's cute. But you wish something was taste. over it? That... I wish that she came out and then, like, she threw the helmet dramatically to the side, took off her jacket, ripped off her pants. And suddenly she was in, like, an evening gown yes, or something. Yes, or something. Yeah. It's cute. It's cute. But not cute enough. Yeah. She made her hair match it. Next um, up, Crystal Method. See? I like this. It's dramatic. It's like a kimono. It's... It's fun. I like it. It shows up Crystal's like it. personality. I hear just stay in your voice. No, I just am not getting what's up with her face. Like, this is the one that she was doing the pink thing. Yeah, it just looks creepy. Like, I don't She's know. She's coming to get you. She is. I like Nicole feel like if I say her name in the mirror three times, she's going to like jump out of it and drag me to hell or something. She's going to pop out and fix yes, your makeup. Exactly. Which is, you know, very nice of her to do. Uh-huh. She's very busy. Nice yes, very nice of her. Okay, that's right. Armpits. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't like what was going on with the hair in that shot. <laughs> um, this one, she says she is uh, oil spill realness because we can't say the word as Ursula. So we're back into so now we're Britta. in the autumn, right? No, yeah. spring, fall, fall. Same so silhouette as her so first Ursula looks. outfit. This is cute. It's very well executed. I do like it the is dress. Ex well executed. Um, I wonder if there was like a. Disney villain that she looks category. like category no because you know how oh. they get lists of like looks to bring because oh. this is very specific it is very specific and so how is this fall yeah maybe the other one Next. had coffee spill on it on her way to the airport I like the Jean head Gaultier. I like that I do like the fascinator like we're now look. on um Nikki Doll I like her outfit I like, I like the, the vest I just, I like this outfit. It's very Overall, clean lines. It's very, it's very well, well put, put together. together. <laughs> it's plain, but it's nice. Yeah. It's clean. And, and I like the hat. I like that big like hat, hat that you can see through it. I would wear that hat. You would wear that hat. 
I would try and wear that hat and it would probably fly off in the wind, but probably. I would try. But you could buy that hat and then you can also sift. <laughs> sift for gold? Sift for gold. All right. <laughs> okay. Two for two, Widow Von Du. I don't like that color on I hate, her. I don't like It period. doesn't scream that this is, you know, the season. I don't yeah. like that hair. It's so big you can't see her face. True. Um, um, I didn't like the tear away. Because it just revealed, like was it a skirt? No, pants. pants. But the color's boring. Yeah, it's very boring. The color's boring. boring. There's no, like... And it's very boring for her skin complexion. Like, it doesn't... Put accent. jewels on it, or put so and something. because it's so oversized, all you see is that dress, her hair, and then her arms sticking out, and it's like there's no shape to it. There's no. It's like a really bad. Um, she looks like something from Beauty and the Beast. One yeah. of the like when the curse she is broken. Yeah. You know she was she was like, one of the napkins, was... and then when the spell was broken, she turned into this. Next. <laughs> oh, we went backwards. Yeah, next goes the other way. There you go. Next up, we have okay. Jack. Jackie, right? Yeah, mm. Jackie. Oh, yeah. Dirty modern Jackie. I mm -hmm. like this one, too. It's this cute. looks like something like you would wear to work. Yes. It is very cute. I like she, it. She's rocking the pants, which is very hard when you're in drag. Like, who mm -hmm. hates pants, pants. on a drag queen? But pants. it looks good. But there was a lot of pants. So not only her, but we also had Nikki Doll in pants. We had Widow Von Dome. Yeah. Um, it's the season of pants. I like little, it. That little headpiece that she has going on for her helmet. You know, it's cute. No, this isn't a helmet. It's just oh, a that's headband. Her hair? Well, yeah, but it's, it's cute. It's Gigi cute. Good is a helmet queen. Oh, that's right. She's going to find out. Queen. Okay, I love this look. Hiding in closet. All right, so that's one point for hiding in closet. I like the hips, the, the panniers above the hips. Yeah. I like the hair. I like this print. She, it's showing off her legs. It's gorgeous. She just needs to work on her makeup skills. She does. Like, seriously. She does. Okay. Next up. Gigi Good. Helmet Queen. I seriously thought she was going to get clocked for that boy for the chest. Pasties? Yeah. There's a lot pasties, of boy, boy chests chest. this year. Okay. So there's no right or wrong way in drag. I would preface it with this. That However, being said, I do like a queen with titties. Yeah. And I mean, Rue. I like the full fantasy. And I know you can do gender bender. I know there's yeah, other stuff. But I mean, like, Rue's thing is she doesn't like to see boy chests on a drag queen. Also, I think Michelle Fassage, right? Yeah. And the thing is, when you're doing their competition show, you kind of got to play by their, their rules, rules. Unfortunately. Yeah. You play by their rules, you get off the show, you make it big enough, and then you do your and own And then rules. you go and do your own thing. But that being said, it is a cute outfit. It shows off her form. I do like it. Uh, it's like she's going to the races, and then she has to go meet her um, slaves after. So, my no, that's my uh, Asian sister from another mister said she is giving um, Violet Chachki a run for her money with I that do. slim I waist. That. Yeah, that's a she's very... We've got to gotta get her on. Yeah. We've also got to get a few other people on. Mm-hmm. We'll keep talking about this. I'll... Freddy Krueger. I have mixed feelings with this. I like it. I don't know if it necessarily works for this runway competition. Again, but I, I wonder like if this is for another category. And yeah. they were just like, um, like we're of course in, like, looking at Crystal costume. Method. Um, I don't like the band-aids on her head. She made it herself, the outfit. Cool. Well, the band-aids, because, you know, she's supposed to have no hair because she's been burned in a fire. Right, so. but... And so what, only now you're caring about? Freddy Krueger Mountain. Recovery? Yeah. Freddy Krueger Mountain. I wish I Mountie. could stop dreaming about you. <laughs> and, and some naked guy's dick. So. <laughs> what queen was that? Oh my listen, god. Listen, that's going to be our OnlyFans. <laughs> Subscribe to our OnlyFans and Patreon and I will show you all the D's. Diversity. What do you think the D stands for? <gasps> Democrat? Okay, so... Okay, so we've done Runway, they're getting out of drag, everyone's, like, seeing each other. Nikki Doll is very into G Gigi Good. Yeah, I like how, like, they always get very, like, ooh, now she's we like, can see them come out. She's like, I guess I gotta put clothes on. And I was like, if that was me, I'd be like, hi, no. No, mm -mm. you don't have to if you don't want to. No. Um, Max the Challenge. So RuPaul tells them they've all gotta rap. write their own rap. Um... It's a very ambitious challenge for a day one. Yes. Um, Britta's very confident. She says she's done um, Broadway tours. She's... But do you do it well? Right. <laughs> Which goes back to Gia Guns. What you think you're going to do mm -hmm. isn't necessarily what you're going to do. I'm a writer, do. but is it any good? It's right. Like, I went to acting school. Okay, but... But do you act? Going to school and actually doing it. Two different yeah, things. there's a lot of shade already. And she's very confident. She said, episode. oh, no, mama. Yeah. I'm good at it. And then she reveals that she's a slow learner. Yeah. 
But then she's okay, and then so they set up with team cap. Well, not team captains, but they assign Widow Von Du in the hiding closet because they're the to dancers. Be choreographers. But in true form of the show, everybody's got to put their two cents in. Yeah. And Britta, knowing that she's the slowest learner, tells Widow Von Du, "Look, this choreography is too easy. You're doing too much of one thing. You're too much repetitive movement. Look, if I was a slow learner, which I am." I would be happy with this, mm -hmm. but yeah, let's keep it simple. Let's keep it tight. So too much for too much chefs in the kitchen. So they're like, okay, how do you do it? Just you. Widow's feeling some type of way, which is normal. Yeah. Then Heidi goes and does the same thing that Widow's doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like I said, it's a hard challenge for day one. You have to rap. You have to dance. It's with it, people you hardly know. With people you hardly know, and do a group challenge. It's very ambitious, but you know. So yeah. and as, essentially, so on this one, so they have their rap challenge. They had their two looks for the mini, and then they have to come up with another a third runway look. It's a packed day. Plus, they have to come up with a look for their rap. So they have to do four looks in one day. Plus their entrance look. So five looks in one day. A lot of them didn't That's think about their entrance looks. Did you like anybody in the rap? I like Nikki Doll. I liked Nikki Doll. She had she had a uh, presence. I like I Jackie. I like Jackie. I like hiding in the closet for her dancing. Yeah. She yeah the girl can dance as long as she doesn't have to talk or Nikki, put on makeup. It's the real widow Van Dio across the stage, mm -hmm. which is impressive. Yeah. It was cute. It was fun. It was cute. Um, Nikki Minaj as guest judge, which so the girls were all like freaking out because to have to rap in front of Nicki Minaj. Is, right. Like, I was it was I was surprised because like I don't follow Nicki Minaj by name, but I'm sitting there listening to her going, oh, I have a lot of her music. I just didn't ever really know who she was. Huh, who huh. thought a white boy like you listen to Weird. Nicki Minaj? yeah. I like Nicki's eyes. They're very expressive in this episode. They're always expressive. Oh, she's got those big eyes going on. Like, oh. Would you download I'm That Bitch? No, probably not. I think I would. Maybe. I would, I would for workouts. For workouts? I do have a lot of RuPaul songs I mean, for workouts. I do have there two from... Um, I have Kitty Girl. I have the UK songs, there too. Oh, you have the UK one? Yeah, they have the two UK songs up on Spotify. And you like them that much? Just two, yeah. It was a good song. That, um, the, Don't Wanna Break uh, Up. Uh, 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 Don't Wanna Break Up. Oh, there is, okay, bye. the one that won. Mm -hmm. I do like that yeah, one. Yeah, The other one was trash. Yeah, but I have them both just because, you know. Because you support the queen. That's right. That's okay, right, so I downloaded it for free on Spotify. we're on the main stage. Okay, wait, let's talk about RuPaul's... If we can go back to the last so, season 11, how we didn't like any Ru or I didn't like any RuPaul's looks. Yes. This season, not going so well either for me. First I don't of all, like that, this. that first entrance when RuPaul came out, she looked gorgeous. She looked so young. That was like so You racist. Oh. But she said this is RuPaul's Drag Race. And she said this is where the queens enter from. Oh, but that not was Nicki Minaj. No. Okay, well, that being said... I'm not a fan of the dress. I like when RuPaul is in floor length gowns. Long, something longer with the slit, not all the way up to her hoochie Also, this hair looks a little dry. You know, you know, it's just Sorry, a little Margaret. Barbie dollish with the little pigtail going on on top. Her mug is good, though. Yeah. Which is surprisingly, I thought Raven was, like, really busy right now because she was doing that Disney stuff, but, you know, she... No, she only... Well, no, she only designed the makeup. She, yeah, but, I mean, that's, that keeps them that busy. That takes, like, what, one day? Oh. To be like, hey, this is how you do it. Are you kidding? Well, like, you design it, and then you show them how to do it, and then your job is done, you collect your paycheck, she, you say bye-bye, I got to go to work But you gotta day. show that whole cast, and there's, like, multiple casts in that How long are you doing day? She approaches you a face try and goes, this is what <laughs> like, oh. If you, you have any questions, ask your Ask teammates. your team captain. This is your colors. Go. Okay. So... First up, we have Greta Felter. So and this is a sparkly a Susie Snowflake. Um, oh yeah, sparkle. I liked the headdress. I liked the face. The Judy Jetson outfit. I like outfit. that it sparkles. I like that it sparkles. I mean, it's not horrible, but no. again, for your first time in the runway. Yeah. And then we have she. Crystal Dove, Crystal Method. She's Powerpuff like a Girl Villain. Sparkly devil thing. I don't like the makeup. They're all red face. Yeah, I don't like that face. little pink face thing. I mean, I get where she's going. It's different. But, I just hope yeah. this isn't every runway. Yeah, I hope not. Also, I wish the tail wasn't so meaty. Yeah. Next up. Gigi Good. Helmet Queen. And a helmet. Is she going to be a helmet queen? She's going to be a helmet queen. And Untucked the Is this all your bringing helmets? And she said, yeah, that's all I packed. No she's, very, she's very pretty. She's very put together. I don't I like, get how the helmet matches. I like the outfit. The outfit, though. It doesn't. It does not. But I think she's supposed to be like a motorcycle girl. Okay. 
It's cute. And the helmet kind of looks like hair almost. Mm, okay. Heidi in closet. Heidi in closet. Love I that gown. I like the gown. She said it was only $9. Everything from the neck up, though, I hate. I like the earrings, though. Yeah. I don't I like, like the, the back of the dress. Back. What? I didn't like it. It's like a sparkly vagina. It's like, that hair is horrible, know. though. Yeah, the hair is really like, bad. Even Nicki Minaj said, I hate your hair and face. The hair was just like... She needs to just blend more. I like Jackie. Jackie Cox. I... I wish Another there was a little look. bit more though to her um her outfit. It's very it is plain. As much as it's sparkly, it's still plain. It's like she's just Do wearing you, a unitard. Do you think though that this is what she always does then? Because I haven't followed her or I don't follow her. I've started following her, but I haven't had a chance to look deeply into her outfits yet. But I mean, it's not a bad look. Yeah, it's just. But odd. you know, Miss Chopin is gonna yeah, say. Yeah, she's gonna be like, "Is this all you can do?" We want something different. Yeah. We want more but than just But it's cute, it's beauty. polished, it's clean, yeah. it's sparkly. It's Did sparkly. you stone those tights? She made that, she worked the challenge. She's walking out. Mm -hmm. Take another pill. Bye -bye. Pill purse. Next up. Nikki doll. I don't get the mask. I don't get the mask. I like this from the titty up. But again, she's in, you know, a bathing suit essentially that has again. stones on it. It's like a corset. But it's not even, cause, yeah, it's panties. a corset, but... I wish the panties sparkled also. Yeah. It looks like she forgot what she was supposed to wear underneath, so she just went Also, I like wish that. this went all the way around yeah. and not just... Widow Von, Von Doot. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that outfit. It's origami. It makes lotus her just flower. have no shape. She has absolutely no shape in there because she's just covered by all this big material. Okay. I didn't then, mind it, but I don't like what's on the side of the hips. The, the side of the hips, and it makes her legs look unproportionate to the rest of her body. Like, uh, she has these super see. small legs with a big body, and it just looks uh -huh. odd. I wonder if... I mean, Sorry, she's a big girl, but she's not that I big of a girl. I do want to talk about it. I wonder if, as a queen of color... Because I know it's hard to find tights yeah. when you're dark-skinned. But those are really dark. Those are really dark. Those are, like, super dark. But, no, I don't know. I know that they have the unfair advantage, so... And maybe on a, a, a slightly lighter one for that outfit, if she's not trying to just go for flesh tone tights, it probably would have been a little better. Yeah. Or a darker outfit to go with the tights, so that it kind of offsets it a little, you know. It's... I guess we'll find out. Yeah, we'll find out on the next episode. Um, we find out also in the workroom that Heidi didn't get a lot of sleep because she had to go to the hospital. To go to the emergency Because room. it might have been either the detergent or the devil's lettuce. Or kale. <laughs> I'm you, I told you once, I told you twice. Don't eat the kale. Don't eat the kale. She, yeah, she's already made her mark as being the crying queen. Do you think so? She's, she was sobbing the whole, like, she's crying about having to go to the emergency room and she's crying about, true. you know. True, okay, true, true. Okay. Like, she cries because Nicki Minaj is like, you butt ugly. You watch her, she's going to get like, too far. She, I don't know. I don't know if she's actually going to get far or not. I think as long as she does good on her dancing challenges, but. But it's not going to be all dancing challenges. I mean, I kind of shudder when it's just kind of like a makeup challenge. She kind of reminds me of also Mercedes Iman Diamond. She kind of also reminds me. Yeah. So we get to the runway. Mm -hmm. uh, the critiques. The critiques. And then we have them all line up. They're all one by one getting safe, safe, yeah. safe. And then we're down to Widow Van Du and Gigi Good. Mm hmm And they're shedding bricks. They are shedding And I bricks. was like, well, I was saying there's no way this is the bottom two because Gigi Good was there. And yeah. they all liked her. Come Widow. to find out. Oh, but Widow. Widow, I could see her being on the bottom. Right, so I thought maybe there wasn't going to be a bottom two. Just yeah. uh, mm -hmm. goodbye. Just goodbye. <laughs> you sucked. No, you didn't, she didn't suck. She just... But we find out that they it. are the top two. And not only do they lip sync for their life, but they also get a cash tip. So we Now, probably... are we doing this the whole season? I know, like, have we turned into... Um, All Stars? All Stars now. Like, are we gonna start doing a lip sync for our li lip sync for our legacy and send the weakest link home kind of a thing? But no, probably yeah, not. I'm sure no. once the whole team's together, then they're gonna lip sync for the yeah. lives. They so they home. they have to battle against each other to see who's the best. And as soon as I heard the song, guys. I was like, okay, there's no way mm -hmm. that Widow Pondu is going home. Yeah, but I I liked Gigi's little or losing. I liked there's no Gigi's um little comedy. Her little she's rusty, doing, yeah. um, Dusty Ray, because Dusty yeah. Ray did the whole same thing. And Dusty, when Dusty Ray lip-synced it against Monet, they also did a Nicki song. Yeah. 
And it was cute. It was fun. And in the end, Widow Von Doom wins. Widow she rips off her costume, which looked better than what she was wearing. Mm -hmm. And she wins. And she wins. And, and the, the loser. And the loser, Gigi Good, is safe. That's bad. She's, She's good. Safe. They're both good. Wouldn't it be interesting, though, if they did the top and the bottom every week? It would be, but. So, like, the bottom gets a chance to. Like the bottom queen against the top queen, and you right. could you could send the top queen packing if you do right. the lip sync. Right, right, That'd right. That'd be an interesting challenge because some of those girls they don't do well in the challenges, but they do great in the lip sync. Right. So. But then how would it? So if you reverse it though, and if the top queen won, would she still win the five thousand and stay? I would think so. We'll see. Mm -hmm. We will see. So both queens are safe. So unlike the first time they did the whole split up episode where the you know. By the time the second girls came in, one girl was already sent home and you never meet right. them. This time, the second set of girls will already meet all the first set of girls. Yes. And it's like, you kind of get like an animosity between the two groups when you do that, or at least the first time they did, where it was teams. team one versus team two. Oh, that was another thing I was telling Sarah. So it would be cool if they kept the teams separate. Yeah. And then who, okay, so say team A won that week's challenge. Team A gets to choose a queen on team B to go home or to be up or, for elimination and RuPaul chooses a queen what if they also the uh, flip flop the teams each week and the teams don't actually meet each other until like you know you get into the top three or four and then suddenly that's when those people are meeting for the first time and then it's all together <sighs> no but I don't see that happening because you know, of under. you'd have a really long season if you did that so overall though I don't think none of these girls really are top contenders for me yet but I don't know maybe next week I feel like Gigi Good would get far. I feel like... She's a good looks queen. I like Nikki, her. I don't know about Nikki Doll yet. Yeah. And so that's the hard thing is... Britta will go far because I know she's gonna make good TV. Yeah. And the producers like that. I like good TV. Heidi is somewhere in the middle. She'll last. Yeah. Who else is there? The hard part is though, it's hard to judge the girls just based off of the first episode. Of... I feel like Crystal Method is gonna be the underdog. Like, she's always gonna turn out looks, but she's always gonna be overlooked because of other queens. You think she's gonna be like a Scarlet? Where she'll kind of like always no, be. No, because. Be in the bottom. Because has talent. I'm just joking. Ouch. I'm kidding. Don't come for me. No, I think. Ouch. No, I think Crystal Method will be like. Well, was, what were some other queens who are like underdogs and they weren't already seen until later? Like Ben Lockham in her original season. Oh, yeah. Um, what else do we have? Um, there was. Well, there's not a whole Widow Von Du. Maybe uh, may last till like episode four or five. Maybe. She's Oof. probably gonna go home on a sewing challenge. Ooh. Maybe. Well, well, we'll see. We'll see. It'll be interesting to see how this season. Look, we kept out. it under an hour, yeah. half well, an hour. But remember, that was like after fifteen pauses. Oh. Yeah, we're at actually like about forty minutes, but it's still under an hour. So yay us! Well, if you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to share and like it and subscribe it. Um, uh, I think this season of Drag Race, I am going to just piggyback off of Taylor D. Oh, fun. Because... I don't know if I can handle that much weight. I'm tired. Just a tired girl. But still go to her podcast and give her love, even though she won't post anything. And Maybe I'll log back in and see There you happens. go. I don't know. Maybe some fun pictures. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And tune in next week when we meet the other six queens. I'm Yay. excited to see Rakam Sakura and Dahlia Sin. Dahlia Sin. Who is a Aja's relative. Daughter? No, I don't think she's her actual daughter. Well, it's her drag daughter, isn't it? No, I think she's just somehow related. No, I think that's her drag daughter. We'll find out. Mm -hmm. All right. Bibbidi-bobbidi-boop. We'll see you later. See you Bye. next time.